Hey guys, it is Friday, I want to say. Must be our last day in Ipswich. But, uh, yeah, it's morning time. Big uh, bark in the morning, took the dogs out. I think after Max already did, I don't know. But, uh, I'm kind of like just hanging out until everybody else is awake, I guess. A little nap. Made some breakfast. Mm. Simulated breakfast burrito. And I made all the tater tots. So many leftover tots. But uh, yeah, you know how it is, guys. We're hanging out for a bit. Researching about this beach. That we're uh, gonna go check out. Yeah, I forgot to bring my mask. And... Everybody's like, oh, we need more beach towels. So they went in and got some beach towels at a store. I still got the uh, the no frills towel, so I'm good. Anyways, though, heading towards, well, maybe there's a sign for whatever this beach is called. <laughs> I forget, and honestly, too lazy to look it up. There's a beach nearby. Oh, Crane Beach. There it is, guys. Costs like $40 to visit this beach. That's a little bit like, ooh, woof. But that's how it is. So, yeah. We got our beach chairs. We uh, walk across the boardwalk. Pretty nice. There's uh, some nice dunes here that are nice and protected. Lots of nesting birds and stuff to use the dunes, just like our dunes. And the water was icy cold. You know, I kind of thought since it was so sunny and hot, like getting here, that the water would be warm, but no, <laughs> it's still ultra cold. And uh, we went in anyways, we actually swam over to the buoy, and we touched the buoy. It was neat. But yeah, we were in there for a little bit longer. I didn't really film much because, you know, it's kind of a busy beach. I didn't want to, like, film random people. But eventually we also went on a walk to the less busy part. We didn't go super far, but it's neat. We actually saw a horseshoe crab at this beach, but I didn't have my phone at the time. The horseshoe crab was like alive and walking around in like the deeper part. And there's a neat crab here. I was like, whoa, this is a big crab. Like, if someone said that you could eat that crab, I believe him. I feel like that's probably big enough that you could eat. And of course, Don's gonna touch it. I was like, Don, touch that crab. And, uh, boom, touching a crab. in all of its crab glory. When we put it back, it started to like dig a hole and like hang out in a hole. I guess that's like a crab thing. Dig a hole. But yeah, just heading back now. Yeah, we had to rent an umbrella. It was so hot. I mean, it seemed worth it. But anyways, heading out. Uh, funny how well this line is working to keep people out of the dunes area. And there are some hikes that you can do in the area. But it's so hot, we're not gonna go for a hike. Instead, we're gonna go back to that beautiful car paradise, the parking lot. Yeah, that's the beach story. So yeah, that was a neat time. I actually had a nap on the beach as well, and my back is burnt. Oh yeah, and you maybe have seen all those like black things on four legs. We thought that those were bird feeders, but were like nesting boxes. But it turns out that they're bug traps. There's like little holes in the bottom that they, these green-headed like flies go into, and then they're too stupid to fly out the bottom. So they just get trapped in there. 
And a bunch of birds have figured out that there's a bunch of bugs in there, so they come and eat the bugs. So you, you know, kind of makes you think that it's a bird-related thing. But yeah, we're back now, and after stopping at the fishmongers, they uh, got some clams, oysters, or something. And uh, yeah. Max shucked and ate a raw oyster, and I think Don was uh, into trying that as well. Me? I'm like, no thank you. <laughs> Apparently it tasted alright though. But they also got some scallops, and just like a scallop fried in a lot of butter. Like, this tasted really good. Honestly, it probably tasted better than the Woodman scallop that was deep fried. Like, just fry it in some butter and like eat that. That was nice. So yeah, just hanging out. Nice to see the dogs chilling. I guess I brought Xena out again. Seems like Xena. Xena's always down to go outside. But yeah, taking in the view. It's nice out here. Oh yeah, and I guess uh, Max actually cooked up some of the oysters, clams, or whatever. And they were alright. Again, I'm kind of like, you know what? I'm good with just chickens. And we watched some YouTube video of some guy picking up uh, clams from the beach. It's neat to see how it's done. But for dinner, we're picking up pizzas from the Riverview, famous for pizza cocktails. Yeah. We got three pizzas. They only make one size of pizza. They were pretty good. So yeah, getting late. Hanging out with the old Xena here. Watching some more of the quarry. The good ending. You know, it's hard to find the true best ending on YouTube. Because everyone says theirs is the true best ending. But really, they're just like good-ish endings. <laughs> I don't know. But uh, that's it for the day, guys. Later.